So I think I'm on the same floor as that Kaisin store and at the back of the Kaisin store there's another building uh, I don't know what this place is about uh, Kaisin store is that way When just now I was going walking around here then I saw the the logo of this one, the red one that one is the logo of uh, the new New Zion New Zion so then I went nearer and now this is another hobby shop a hobby shop indeed it's called the Red Comet so it's another name for Shah Aznubu and there's an android uh, picture of uh, Shah Aznubu oh my god fucking hell so oh shit oh I can see all of them are like hiya yeah. I can see a lot of Gundams oh my god yeah pretty good as well Nanyang so this is another great find and uh, let's take a looky looky Wow there's a lot of zakus here oh my god holy shit so I can see this one here is a zaku in a red comet style and we have the sasabi here the old older version and you can see the heat is a bit big but oh my god, it's a nice finish. The, the color is a silver red. Very nice and professional indeed. Very, very nice. And there's a Sinanju there. And there's that, uh, what should I call it? Zion. And there's a super sized, uh, I don't, I think it's a, is it perfect grade? I think it's a perfect grade Zaku. Yeah, red colored one and all of them are all red and there's a gel gold there as well very very shiny red and uh, looking at all these things here the zaku here is wow it's modified to the brim already so it looks very nice with all the missile pods almost like uh, heavy arms of Gundam wing and there's the white uh, zaku I think Shin Matsunaga maybe very very nice indeed and this one is a very very weathered red Zaku. I think it's the Johnny Ridden one because Johnny Ridden has the this type of legs, you know, with the clusters. And we have a very very battle heavy or battle endured uh, goof. And another goof here, which is uh, very very silver and modified as well. Very nice. The getting done, they done something with this part here. They done it. Then the 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 energy cables also in the same way as the heavy arms from uh, from Titi Hongli so it's all metal and uh, yeah, a lot of Zakus here and this is the new Zaku 06S or something uh, it was made, I don't know what year, because of the Unicorn uh, anime series and there at the end there there's another nice looking Zaku that has those uh, shoulder, you know, the chest catling guns same as heavy arms Gundam from EW or Endless is it endless box or can wing? I'm not sure. And here we have the rest of the stuff. Very nice indeed. There's some more at the back there actually. Then here is the Gundam wing. The, the heavy arms here, not with the vibrant colors, but it's all been uh, the colors have been muted, so it looks much less plasticky. And we have the Shenglong here. The accent looking. Uh, Death Side Hell, and we have the Gundam Wing here, the, the Strike Freedom, the Espion, which is uh, piloted by the, I think it's the main villain's Gundam. And then we have the Unicorn here, very nice indeed. I think they changed the colors, I don't know, I think they changed it. Looks uh, like Looks like uh, jet, not jet black, uh, muted black, uh, carbonized black, not sure. So we have the blitz here as well. And uh, my favorite, uh, the uh, Easy 8. But the weathering is not as good as it can be, I think. And the rest here, no idea. No idea. Oh, hammer, I think. So let's go and take a look at, at this here. Oh, 
Oh, this is a workshop. And we have, wow, there's a master grade, uh, what should you call it, cubile here, painted as well. And we have the O here, also painted green, the side arms. And we have the new yes. Evangelion. Hiya, how are you? Yes. So, uh, this shop here, how long has it been open? Mm, seven months. Seven months? Yes. Oh, is it the first shop or is it a branch of something else? First shop. First shop, yeah. uh? so uh, are you the boss? I'm part of the Part of the boss. Part of the yeah. boss, uh, one of the partners. Uh. So this is a workshop? Uh, part of the workshop also. Oh, part of the workshop. Yeah. Uh. The workshop is inside. Oh, the workshop is inside. Yes. Uh. So you sell you sell all these Gundams and Gundams all these... and the Warhammer. And Warhammer. Yeah, the GW products. So the Warhammer, is so is it very popular in Malaysia? Um, starting. Starting to. Going to. Okay, well, I see a lot of people playing with the cards or something like that. Uh, but uh, for the Warhammer, it's not a card. Not a card. Yeah. The, the it's small like little. It's a table game. You see, all the chess. Oh, all these are Warhammer. Yeah. Uh. It's like a fantasy. Yeah, this is a fantasy type. And then the other kind is the 40k. 40k. Oh. Yes. 40k is more advanced, like the mechanic parts. So. Mechanic parts, uh, huh? All the robots, the high tech. High tech. Uh. High tech one. So, uh, what's your name? Did I ask you? Oh, my name is Kid. Sorry? Kid. Kid, uh, yeah. Jericho. So, uh, how about, uh, can you take me through all the things that you have here? Oh, well, these are the Gundam series. Gundam, uh, do you yeah, from do the Bandai Gunpla. Ah, uh, Gunpla. Yep. Okay, uh, who, who's the one who did most of this work? All of us. All of you, yeah. huh? So, uh, can you like open it uh, so I can uh, shoot it properly without the glare? Is it okay? Yeah, no. So, is, uh, this guy is doing the... Hi, sir. Hi. Oh, you have to paint everything, one. Yeah. You can hear the rear of the airbrush. So, uh, kid. So, what is this, ah? Uh? What's this? Oh, those are the Zoid from the Tommy Takara. Oh, Zoid, uh, Yeah. Is it very popular? Not really, but Not really. for the. For the model kit, it's very it's quite oh, detailed. Very, very detailed. Yeah. Uh, maybe, uh, I, actually, I don't fancy this here, you know, it's like uh, back in the 80s. Mm, 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 when, you know. No, it won't be. You see? You can take it off like that. Huh? Yeah. Like that one? Uh? Yeah. It's broken, is it? No, this one is uh, this one because last time I already stick to it already. Oh, it's a book Yeah. For the rest one, it's okay, you see. You can twist it like this, it's okay one. Oh, okay. But this one last time because it's my first model, and oh, then oh, your first I got model. a bit, yeah, a bit mistake on it, mm -hmm. and here so I twist it too hard, it's broken. So, so now it's stuck already, Yeah. So how it's do okay. how do I you repair? I just put it back with the super glue. So, super glue, uh, yeah. should, Shouldn't you use that? Uh, what do you call that thing, uh, uh, the one that melts plastic one? Uh, so uh, I mean the so, uh, what do you call it? Chloroform. Something else. Something else. Ah, it's not chlor. Uh, the one that melts one, uh, you know the panel lining one. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Party, no. Is it cement or party or something like that? No, cement is also one part of that. Ah. But we are not using that. Oh, okay. So can or not? Yeah, can. Can uh? mm. Oh, okay. Just to hold the, just to hold the shape only. Okay. If we are using the party, we have to paint. We have to do the painting already. Because it's white. Yeah. Isn't there the party that is uh, clear? No, it's not. It's the eyes for us to use to cover the line. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So uh, the Zoids one, uh, is it uh, is it anime? Uh? Yeah. Oh, it's anime. Uh? Yes, it's from the anime. Is it from the eighties or seventies or? No, quite no, long, 90. quite quite old. Uh. So yeah. Very old. So there's no current series. Uh? For the series, uh, ah. there's four series. Four series. Uh. Good story or not? Yeah. Good story. Okay uh. For the first and the second season. Uh. Oh, okay. Most of the animations until the third season they are very lousy. Very lousy, yeah. but the first and second one is good. Uh. But for the because the story keep continue ah. and then until the end they got nothing to say already. Oh okay. So what yeah. but for the Gundam there's different. Every Gundam series they got every different different story. Oh okay. So is it humans humans uh, piloting yeah. them? Uh? Oh okay. So you can see here is a heavy uh, no ah, that's armored core. That's what is other from the game. Armored armored core. Yeah. So this one is from the MSE glue? No, this one is from the Gundam series. Yeah, the MSE glue. Yeah. Is it transformable? No. No. But you can transform. 
it's not transformer. Ah yeah, it, it can transform lah. Yeah. yeah. Very nice and very big. Is this a third party or is it Bandai one? Bandai one. Bandai, so big ah? Yep. Master grade ah? No, this one got no grade. High or oh, no grade ah? Oh, non grade one ah. Oh, okay. It's like the EX model. It's a special model. Ah, uh, no grade ah. Mm. And down here is the Lego. Oh. Yep. Okay. So this is the real grades? Yes. Very small ah, so fucking small. Yeah, but they are very detailed. Very detailed, but more detailed than the uh, than the than master, the master grade. grade. Yeah, I'm just waiting for them to port it to the master grade, lah. No, they, no, they, they, this one already done, one. No, this one is the version three. Ah, uh, yeah, version three. Ah, uh, version three, lah. But, la, but it's different from the RG. It? Still got different from the RG also. Ah, uh, what difference? Difference is mean that they are different size. Ah, uh, okay. And then the the parts of the inner the inner part, uh. and the by the. All the algae, the inner part is coming with a fixed one. Yeah, so when you cut it down, uh, easy. It's, a, it's a whole thing already. Very easy. So you can just bend it. But for the washing tree, they didn't have. The tree is uh, also very detailed. They do a lot yeah, of work. You have, have to fix yourself. Inner frame. Inner frame. Nah, that's nicer. La. You can do it yourself. Huh? But for this one, it's just for you. The inner frame is like just a, yeah, piece, a uh. piece of stick like that. Uh -huh. So you have to put, up, put down all the parts. So how how is it? Uh, do you think is uh, Do you like the real grade? Yep. I mean, if you were to move it around, Will it break the inner frame? No, it won't. It won't? Uh? Yeah. You don't go and purposely go and bend it? Uh? Uh, no, <laughs> you want to play with it carefully. Will it like stress or not? The no, plastic? It won't. Uh, yeah, if you fix on everything, it won't be easy to, it won't be easy to break. Oh, okay, it won't be easy to break. Mm -hmm. So, this is the first time I'm seeing this uh, up close, so you can lot, see a lot of uh, color separation. All the different sh uh, hues of this uh, Charles Saku, and this one here, you didn't do much all uh, this panel lining only or on all this. For the RG, we didn't do we didn't do a, any painting. It's good enough. Just do the panel lining only. Mm. But this one is nicer, lah. This one, this. Yeah, this one is nicer. This freedom. Yeah, this one is the RG freedom bundle. Mm. So has it come out already? The Strike Freedom RG? Not yet, lah. Haven't. It will, it will release on the December from mm. Japan. Okay, December. Oh, what what what's your feelings on the new Sasabi coming out? Oh, this one, perfect. Perfect. Yeah. The World Car version, eh? Yeah. So uh, what what about your thoughts on this one here? This uh, Sasabi. Do you do you like this Sasabi at all? Um, when I first saw, that's okay. Uh -huh. But after I saw the version car, then this one can stand aside. <laughs> okay. Okay. Before the version car, did you have any, I mean, dislike for the Sasabi, you know, the Master Grade one? But actually, the Sasabi is not belong to me. I mean, uh, in your personal view, uh. mm, To me, the Sasabi is just okay. Only. Okay, yeah. Because I'm not the one who collect the Sasabi. Oh, okay. The one who collect the Sasabi is my brother. Oh, okay, okay. Who's he's the one? The, he's the Shah fans. Shah fan. Oh, the Shah fan, uh. Yeah. The whole set from the Shah as number one. He's the one who collects it. Oh, okay. So one of the partners, is it? Yeah. One of the partners of this shop here? Main, uh, main Gerald. Main Gerald. Yeah. Okay, his name is Main Gerald and he likes Shah. So you have also the... Is it the same guy who did all these things? Yep. Oh, okay. It's not around, is it? Yeah. It's not around? It's not around. Oh, I can see the old... Uh, he has uh, colored it differently, the green here instead yeah, of yellow. Because he just, did, he just painted that. The way he's, he likes. He likes, huh? Yeah. Wow, very big, uh, the old. Well, this one also, the the cubile looks very nice. Very nice indeed. And very big as well. Then this one here is the new Evangelion, huh? Yeah. You need what, huh? Ten. You need uh? six. You need six, huh? Yeah. This is uh, piloted by that, uh, that what's his name? That uh, an it's an angel, uh, yes. it's But an this angel. one, the main color is uh, dark blue. Oh, dark, dark blue. blue. So yeah. you change, he changed yeah. it, uh? Looks nice as white, but you didn't didn't get to see the action, uh, mm -hmm. This this uh, unit in action in the movies, uh. Um, for parts only. Yeah, just okay, the last. throwing the spear only. That's all. Oh yeah. Uh, what do you understand it, uh, mm -hmm. The Evangelion movies. Actually, for the old one, I feel that very boring. Ah. So that's why I'm. What the hell? The first, the first, uh, the first set of the Evangelion ah, the anime. animations. I feel like very boring. I don't okay. know what he's doing at the, at the end. Okay. But for the new one, um, the graphic is not bad. 
the story at the end also I also don't know what he's doing. Confusing, huh? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I also don't know what the hell. The third the third movie was uh, I I don't. I Suddenly don't know. they say the one the second second impact, third impact, yeah, whatever. Second impact, I don't know yeah, what the hell. Know, but suddenly it break up already, and then you say you're oh, 15 years ago, but they still look like kids. Yep, the effect of piloting the air buzzer. <laughs> so weird, uh, I don't know, I don't understand at all. So we have the Xiong there, the complete Xiong with the legs there at the back there. And we have a Kasatria there. Ooh. I actually really like the tank, very nice. Wow, what the hell? So cute, huh? And we have the real grade of the Destiny, full blast mode. Then the Zeta, Zeta looks nice as well, in real grade form. And also the, the 178 mobile suit, Titan colors with the Walkman headset. And this one, the white one, the Federation color also comes with the head, Walkman headset. And we have the Infinite Justice here. No, no, sorry, the Justice real great and we have the remastered uh, strike Gundam with everything with all the backpacks and stuff and at the back there we have the sky grasper sorry sky grasper and uh, we have the goof at the back of the goof so both the goofs here they have different backpacks so this one has been modified the one that is uh, shining and this one I don't know what it's called already it's from uh, uh, no idea actually. Actually, it looks nicer. The more you see this uh, this unit here, the more it grows on you. It's something like the back, uh, like a knight. And we have the Hakushiki here, very silver, very nice. And this is a Kasachua, done in very nice emerald and silver paint. Looks not bad. And we have the high grade cubile here. Is it a high grade cubile? Very small. So small. Isn't it? So we have uh, seen the Sifu doing some uh, some stuff. I think it came in black, uh, the whole set. Came in black, uh. This yep. one the this one the unit. Mm -hmm. Came in black then you had to colour um, for this is all the from the Warhammer. Okay. It's like just a uh, scenery like that. So the everything from the Warhammer is uh, got no color. You have to paint yourself. Okay. That one is uh, before paint or what? Already paint. Oh, painted already. Yeah. Uh. So yeah, you those for Warhammer the color like this, they are before paint. Oh, what's that? Uh? This is um of the grass from the tree leaf tree oh, leaf. Oh, the tree leaves. Uh. Yes. So your, the main uh, business is to color everything then sell it off? Huh? Not really. This one we have to... Because some of the customers they come and ask for us to paint for them. Uh -huh. And then some of them they are, we are just doing for ourselves. Oh, okay. Okay. Maybe the EXS Gundam there. And the armored core as well there. Cool. Thank you, kid. You're welcome. Quite nice. Uh, this one reminds me of uh, Starcraft 2 actually. This one here. This one also uh, Warhammer. Uh. Yes, this one is a Warhammer 40k series Necron. Oh, it looks nice. Eh? Yeah. Very nice. And... Especially for this one, they remind, uh, they remind me as the Terminator. Oh, Terminators. Uh. Did you play the game from the Relic one? You mean the computer game? Ah. No. I didn't. Oh, okay. So more on the card game lah. No, table game. Table game, you it's uh, strategic and nicer. Yes. Oh, okay. I haven't played it before, but. but if you want to play the table game, you have to read the rules book first. Is it, the is it very complicated? Book. At first, yes. At first, uh. After that, you feel like it's very easy. So it's very fun lah. Yep. Okay. But you have to read the rule book and then the. If you want to be a professional, professional? you have to read the another fifteen books for the every races. What? Fifteen books. Uh. Gila, la. Is it a thick book? Ah? Yeah. This is Warhammer 40k.
Now this one is the unpainted version now. Yep. Those are only put on the primer. Primer? Yeah. Primer is grey in colour one? Uh, any colour. There are a lot of colour for the primer. Not just the grey colour. There is a black, red, blue, yellow. White? Yes. White is the most important now? No? For what kind of figure for what kind of figure you are doing? For what kind of paint you are what you are planning to do? I say if I if the sasabi is red in color, you want I want to paint it yellow. Then you put some some primer on it. No, you have to first. You have to put the primer on to make it to become less red. No, white color first. Light color. White. White. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. If you are painting the metallic or the silver color, uh -huh. you have to put the base color for black first. Sorry. Black color for the base. Ah, uh, for the silver base. Okay. Because for the for the silver color, you need the black base to make it shine. Okay, okay. Like this kind of silver. Uh huh. All of the all of the unit, they are undercoat is the is black color. Black. Uh. Yes. So you put black first. Yes. Then silver. Yeah. Why don't you just put silver? No, it won't shine. You will see the silver a bit dark. Huh? Really? Uh? Yeah. That's that's the trick. Uh. Put. That's that's the that's the way to do to do the paint the silver color. Oh, put black, make it black. What kind of black? Black color, just, just black, just totally black. black. Yes. Totally black. But there are so many types of blacks. Gloss black. No, 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 just black. If you want to make the silver more shine, uh -huh. use gloss black. Gloss black. If you black. don't want the silver so become so shine, you just use flat black. Flat black. Yeah. If you use the if you don't want the silver look so nice, you can use you don't you don't use black. Oh, okay. So the one of the tips is to use black first, then yes. Yeah. So is it okay to do that with a brush instead of airbrush? Very hard. Oh, very hard. Uh, yeah. yeah. Because it uh, leaves a stroke, right? Brush strokes and stuff. It's quite nice. Actually. Just want to see the slaves there. I think maybe. Oh, that one. Mm, this is a master. What's that? Uh? The one in one. Yeah, the one. This one. Ah. The big one. Ah. This is the Necrons that they call the Vault. It's a boss. Uh? Um, it's from the, it's, you have to follow the Apocalypse rules. Looks cool. Very cool indeed. Okay, okay. Those are the fantasies, the Ogre Kingdom and the Vampire Warhammer as well, huh? Yes. Oh, yeah. Ghibli, is it? Is it from Ghibli? Yeah. Ah. Ah, uh, this one is from Bandai. It's the high grade version of that uh, hill dove. So it's no, not that one is same. Same, same uh. this one. So it's a high grade, uh? Yes. But you see the model scale is in. I think it's around one four four only. Yeah, the high grade. But the one four four, the size is quite. It's very huge. Yeah, yeah, it's very huge indeed. This one, how much? Uh? Yep. How much is this? Uh? This one is two hundred eighty. Two hundred eighty. Yeah. Quite big, huh? Very big indeed. Mm. Oh, what's this already? Huh? Huh? Pardon? What's this? Uh? High, high new, huh? New Ganda. Just is, new gun up. Chat a bit fit the bit the face is a bit chat up. Hmm? The face is a bit chat up. Um this one is from the what they call from the China Oh China made no. one. Uh? It's a another company from the China one. High grade uh, MC model. Yeah. MC model. Yep. The MC model for the new Gundam is not so nice, but the high new is very nice. High yep, new over there. That one. Oh this one? Uh? Yeah. The blue one? Uh? Yep. Oh yeah, the MC model why they keep on 
producing so many of these high news, huh? No idea. Always high I news. Think they got a lot of high news, or high news and news and them. I wish they would do something else. But huh? that's the first one. Oh, that's the first one. That's huh? the first one. This both of this. Oh, the first model from the MC. Model. A bit smaller for high grade, huh? but um, this one is the one four four. One four four. One four four high grade. For 144 size, it's quite big already. Yeah, bigger yeah. than no, normal. Those are the normal 144 also. Yeah. Uh, yeah, MC model is always bigger, slightly bigger one. Uh, because they are from resin kit. I think they copy no, from these, resin kit. Uh, yeah, the, the detail. So this one here? This blue one, what is it? This one, the original is Bandai, but this one is not the, not, not the Bandai one. Uh. The TT Hongli or GHD? Yeah, uh, this one is uh, TT Hongli one. TT Hongli, not the GHD. Uh. No. The GHD, what's your opinion on GHDs? The I model GHD? Okay. But I only know that from the those from the China one, they yeah. the, for their plastics, not so nice. Yeah, the plastic can crack quite a lot. Easy to crack. Easy to crack, I know. You okay. press hard, you press too hard, you ah, will crack. Right? You will crack. Micro cracks and whatnot. Uh. Terrible. Well, this is what pirated version area. Yeah. This one, this here. No, actually, this one, you cannot say that it is a pirated. Because third party la. No, this is the original original design from the MC. It's not copy design from the Bandai. Bandai got didn't have this design, you know. Yeah, because all the new random the parts ah. from the leg and the arms, they are curved one. Not ah. like this one. Oh, and this bit square and yeah. like a Evo version or something. Yeah. Isn't it? Evo. Mm. Oh, all oh, like that. So it's like not third party. It's third party lah, they call it. Yeah, nicer yeah, word yeah. lah, it's yeah. nicer word. It's third party lah. <laughs> so uh, you prefer the Bandai's instead of the third party ones? Uh? Yep. For the Bandai's one, the quality is better. Yeah, definitely better and the price is better as well. No, that's okay. It's okay. Reasonable. Reasonable. Uh. So it's the wow, very big box. Uh. Yeah. It'll make you a big figure. Again. Quite big, aren't they? So these figures are from those boxes. Today. Yes. Okay. So you recommend that I go and watch the first and second season of Zoids? Uh? Yeah, that's better. After that, no. After that, no, thank you. No, oh, thank you. <laughs> okay. So kid, uh, follow the advice of kid. Actually, the Zoids also look very nice. Eh? Yeah. But, but did you... this one is from the season 3. Oh, season 3. Eh? Yeah, this 3 is from the season 1. Season 1 and season 2. So all, all of them are piloted by the same fella, is it? This two only. This one is different. It looks like the same basic model, but uh, they added some uh, yep. backpacks and stuff like that. Color also. Did, this one, did you do any modification to it? And yeah. like say, coloring? No. no. Only do the <coughs> panel lining. Panel lining only? Yes. Oh, okay. So the, the spoke wheels of the joints also s comes in silver or make greyish thing? But some of the colour I do some touch up for the colour. Oh the touch up? Yeah. Such as such as? Such as the you see the pipe. In the inside there is, you can see the mechanic part the, with the springs. Yeah, and then some of the parts we I just put on the put on some colour like the you see the exhaust pipe like that. Uh -huh. yeah. Those so colour make, only. make it more like a steel pipe. Right? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm still lo loving this one. Uh. Who did this one? Uh? Hmm? Who did the Hildehoff? The tank one? The master. Oh, the, mas the master. Yep. What's the master's name? Um, this one, uh, master name, Mr. Po. Mr. Po? Uh. Yeah. The, I, I like the, the green, how he did it, the weathering. How does he do it? Uh? Uh, is he like, it's not hot so much. Uh. Uh, when he's, no, he's just concentrating on concentrating the, on, yeah. to, on doing the models. Okay. Wow, oh, a lot of Mr. Color Tinner. Yeah. Oh, this is there. And some of the Evangelion 06 colored white. And a mask rider as well. This mask rider, uh, it, you have to like say, uh, put it together. Yeah, you have to, you have to assembly, uh, assembly. Oh, okay. Well, the Galgo also very big as uh, the box. Yeah, yeah. 
We have the new boxes, the Gundam Mage, then the Marasa, I think. No, this one is the Gyaradoga. Oh, sorry, Gyarad. Marasa is over there. Ah, the Marasa. And we have the... Macross. Macross. Is it bigger? Macross. No, for the size, it's yeah, quite big. You have a sample? No. Oh, okay. Then we have the... Might be mastered. Strike. Gundam. So how is it, uh, the build for the macros? Have you done it? Have you done it before? No. no. But they say the parts is quite a lot uh, for the parts. A lot of transformable. Uh, transformable. Uh. Yeah. So what are their names? Yeah. What are their names? Oh, they are their names. Yeah. yeah. That's Mr. John. Mr. John. Yeah. Okay. The one is not a printer. Hmm? It's not a printer. No, he got no, he got nothing to do, so he do he is playing the game. Oh, okay. What's his name? Yeah, Mr. Tan. Mr. Tan. Yeah. And one, who is the one who went into the toilet? There's also Mr. Tan. Okay, there are two Mr. Yeah. Tans here. Okay, okay. Nice, sir. Yeah. It's a tour. Yeah, and there. those are the rule books. Rule books for the Warhammer. So they, this place also they sell uh, the colors for all these things. Oh. Yeah, this is the paint. The paint, sir. Huh? Mm. So it's not Mr. Hobby, lah. No, this one is Citadel from so the game workshop. Same oh, from Citadel, yeah. huh? Same from the Warhammer. Same with the Warhammer. So you use the this color instead of Mr. Hobby for the Gundams, sir? Uh? No, I use this. I use this paint for Warhammer. No. Warhammer only, yeah. Uh? Is it different from Mr. Hobby? Yes, because Mr. Hobby you have to mix with the thing. Uh. But this one is a water base. Water base? Uh? Yeah. Water base can rub off easily, right? No, when it dry already, it becomes waterproof. Dry early? Or oh, you already dry, it will uh. become waterproof. Oh, like that one? Uh? Yep. Model, uh. yeah. This is a brochure, this is a brochure for the Wario. Oh, it's a new yeah. one? Uh? Not really, but for the for the for the other kind of the metallic paint, yes, there's new one. Oh, metallic paints, eh? I don't like using the... I've used the Gundam marker mm -hmm. for gold and and silver. Mm -hmm. The gold one does not look gold at all. No, now we have the new type of gold that's called the Wario, Wario Liquid Gold. Uh, no, I'm talking about the Gundam marker. Yeah. It's crap. Yeah, but for the gold color, if some of our customers are asking for the good gold color, we will recommend this one. Or oh, Balejo. Yeah. Because this one you can use it on a handpiece and use with brush. Oh, okay. How much is it? This one is 80, uh, 28 ringgit. 28 ringgit. Yeah, eh? for a bottle. Okay. This one is around 35 mil, uh, milliliter. Okay, 35 milliliter. Yeah. Is it is it like Mr. Hobby one? Uh? No, it's different. Water base. This one you can mix with thinner. Oh, mix you with thinner. Yeah, you also can use with brush. Okay, so the in Penang they have this one here. Sell the this shop sells all this uh, stuff for coloring. So how is, how much is the weathering kit? Weathering kit is twenty eight ringgit. Twenty eight ringgit. Yes. Not oh, twenty seven. Sorry. Oh, weathering. Oh, there are so many colors, isn't there? Yeah. What's so different about this? Uh, uh, how this one is uh, using what brush? Is a dry powder thing, isn't it? No, it's like the cosmetic, you know. Oh, co co cosmetic. Co cosmetic. The, yeah, but inside there, there's with the come with the brush ah. and the rubber brush. Rubber brush. Yes. So you just apply on it, and uh, you dr it won't dry. It's just it's no, just there. No, you have there. to you have to put on the another coating first. Ah, what's the coating? That one is the flat coating. Flat clo yeah. coating. Yeah. I'm using this one. Using this one. 
to make it flat first and Mr. then the surface the surface won't be so smooth already and yeah. then you can apply on apply on the weathering muscle if not if the surface is quite very smooth you can uh -huh. apply it oh oh it's something like uh, preparing it uh, pro preparing yeah. the plastic for the weathering uh. yep so uh, it's not shiny lah. This one. No. This one is uh, flat. You flat. said it flat. Flat. It's very very flat. Oh, how much is this one? This one costs for thirty ringgit. Thirty ringgit. Yes. Eh? Just uh, spray on it lah. Yep. So it won't like uh, dilute the colors that you put on, like say Mr. No. Hobby. No. Oh. So it's not uh, not thinner. La. No, it won't. It won't. It won't, it won't affect the color. Color. Oh. But it's thinner base. Oh, marker also won't affect lah. Yeah. The marker one uh, I I use it lah. Uh, it mm -hmm. can come out or no? This one, Mr. Gundam, Mr. Mr. Gundam Marker. Even Gundam Marker. Ah, can come out, it's not nice. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's terrible. So, there is a Mr. Color. Yeah. And more, more hammers. Wow, what's that? Ah, uh? oh, there's a figure case for the war hammer. Oh. It's like the casing that the gamers they play the time they want to play the time they want to take their models to the to the gaming place mm -hmm. so they have to need a case to keep their models. Oh okay, so you must play the game with models, ah. Uh. Hmm? You must play the game with models, ah. Uh. Small model little statues. Yes. So is there like uh, a lot of those uh, competitions going on? Warhammer competitions in uh, Malaysia. Malaysia, um, only in Kuala Lumpur. Kuala Lumpur. Yeah. Okay. But for Penang, next year is going to have a tournament for the Warhammer game. Oh, is it something like uh, like Bandai's? Uh... No, no. no. We are what? the one who organize. Oh, who? We are the one. You guys? Yes. From your company? Yep. Oh, in Penang? Lah. Yep. So I think you have to let me know so I can come and cover it. Next year, March. Next year, March. Uh, where, where's the venue? Huh? Venue. Oh, Times Square. Times Square. Yeah, that? Behind the behind Gamma Supermarket. Oh, Gamma Supermarket. Ah. Yeah, behind the behind the Gamma Supermarket. Gamma Supermarket is still here. Yeah. Oh, still here. Okay. So I guess that's about it. Uh, you don't. You guys don't do war. Uh, World War Two. No, for the military we don't do. Oh, you don't do. Yeah. Uh? We only doing the war hammer more. More for more on the war hammer. Oh, okay. So yeah, very nice. Uh, do come to this shop here to look at some of the excellent Gundams. And also uh, marvel at the Warhammer uh, statues, especially uh, this section here. This one I like best because it's so silver and green. Uh, what kind of green did it, uh, you, that the person used for this one? This one, you have to pay, you have to put on the silver first, like this. Put like the those. silver, uh -huh. and then you spray the clear green on it. Clear the, green. Yeah, the Gaia clear green. Ah. Gaia can, color. Can use brush. Okay, silver then. Clear green. Yes. Okay. Uh, how about put silver? Then I make the green by diluting ten percent of normal green and eight, 80 90 percent of of uh, clear clear paint. No, it won't be. And yeah. lots of thinner. Yeah. Yeah. Because the because the normal green they are not the uh, transparent green. The clear green, they are purposely do for the they are purposely make it for like the transparent color. Ah, transparent yeah. color. That's what they call the clear color. Okay. Uh, very, very nice, nice. So uh, I'm gonna like go off topic and ask you. You're from uh, Penang, right? Yes. Uh, Melayu, you can? No, Chinese. Okay, sorry. <laughs> sorry. So uh, uh, in Penang. What's your favorite food? Penang, favorite food. Yeah. Everything. Everything. Yeah. yeah. So what's your favorite? Hmm? What's your favorite? As long as that there's good food, that's my favorite. Okay. So you what do you recommend the the people uh, which or what area to try? Good ones are uh, not the famous one. Uh, famous one it might not be as good as it should yeah, be. The uh. famous one is Jerusalem. They just got their name only. Oh, and yeah. the Gurney Drive is the same thing. Gurney Drive was it famous for? Nothing. Just the uh, just the name only. Which people one? Come out the out, all the all the people from the out station when they come in they just think okay Gurney Drive I'm going. The hawker lah. Yeah, hawker store. I heard the one of my friend uh, friends uh, by the name of uh, Suri. She said that the Asam Laksa there is quite good. 
asam laksa. So, from you get if you want to try the good asam laksa, it's a good item. Oh, Keloxia. Yeah. That's all, ah. Yeah. I think okay, so so only, lah. For me, it's famous. What? That one? Oh, I think it's already changed people. Because the old one, they say the old man already passed away. Huh? For a few years ago. Okay. For now, the famous Tapsam Laksa, I don't... I haven't known yet. Oh, you haven't eaten? Ah? No, I haven't. Have, there's no one knows where is the famous. Mm, I because they... the famous one already passed away, so oh, no one knows. Oh, famous one yeah. passed away. Ah. Okay. It's alright, lah, the one that I tried in Keloxi one. It's okay. Mm -hmm. well, still a lot of people go there. Uh, it's a bit sweet. Lah. Because it's a uh, famous one. Because the old one... Uh, Old, old, old man that passed down to the, the, son, to the new for the new people. Okay. I'm not sure there's a son or, or who. So, Asan Laksa still go to Aitam Galaxy there. Oh, so, what about uh, uh, Chakwita? Oh, Chakwita, we'll go to Lorong Salamat. Lorong Salamat, the yeah. Twisted Sisters, is it? Part of them, they say there's a best one. But oh. just the prawn is bigger only. And too expensive, huh? Yeah. For the, no, but if you want to say the, the most famous. For the most best chakwitel in Penang, you have to go to what is called this. What is called the Macalester Road? Macalester Road, ah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, yeah I'm not not quite sure about the road name. Also very expensive, lah. Yeah. Huh? Some sort like that, around eight. four to five ringgit, like that. Ah, four to five ringgit, lah. Ah. That's okay. It's not like eight ringgit or ten ringgit. No, eight ringgit or ten ringgit. There's only the where you say the the sisters one. Oh, the sisters, ah. Yeah. Huh? Is it, is it nice? Uh? I mean, sisters, uh, you, you are eaten? Uh? Uh, the meat is so so. <laughs> okay, chicken rice? Sorry. Oh, sorry. Chicken rice, you have to go to, you know, Penang Road. Penang Road? There's a camping camping coffee shop. Oh, sorry? The cam, camping coffee shop. Cam, 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 camping. King, oh, Kingpin. Yeah. Kingpin coffee shop. Yeah. Uh, it's not that famous, but it's good. Uh. Not, is it? not. Uh, it's very famous. Very famous. Yes, and that is a very good one. So you try the chicken or the char siu or the. No, no, no. It's only still chicken rice. Oh, chicken yeah. rice, chicken rice. Boiled chicken. Boiled or oh, the yellow chicken ah. Yeah. Not the roasted one ah. No. So this uh, place here, the taste, the Kingpin restaurant. Uh, Mr. Kid here recommends. Uh, go to Penang Road. Go to the Kingpin restaurant. Try the, the boiled chicken rice. He it says it's the best. So. If it's not, then come and kill him. Okay. <laughs> so what else is there? Uh, what else food? You know, uh, do you know that the Jalan Burma one that uh, there's one restaurant? I don't know what's the name of it. It's a Chinese one. Uh, yeah, a few branches, and they serve char siu, which is sweet and very nice one. Jalan Burma near Midlands, same street at Midlands. No, no idea. Oh, okay. I also forgot the name already. I ate there, the char siu is very sweet and very nice. Very sweet. So what else is that that's good? What kind of food are you looking for? Sorry, huh? What kind of food are you looking for? Chinese food, I guess. Chinese food? Oh, tom yum. Tom yum? Huh. Tom yum, you have to go to Thailand. That's bad. Okay, never mind. Uh, anything that's a very good one? Very don't, good one. No, don't, give me, don't give me the famous, famous one. Uh. It's famous in name only, but quality is different. Uh. Uh, this one definitely. Uh, Chendo one is still good, uh, the one in uh, Penang. Chendo one is same. Same, same uh, very good. Uh, just now I interviewed the Mr. Shit, forgot what's his name already. I interviewed him and uh, yeah, he says that you should use very good products. Uh, make sure it's fresh and uh, they, then the customers will come in and still be good. Yep, so if you want to ask about the for food, I have no idea because I have to know what kind of food is. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, thank you, Mr. Kit. I guess uh, that's the, the end of this Gundam hunt in uh, Prangimor. I'm quite surprised to find your pl your place because I was uh, I went to that uh, Kai Sin store to check out the pirated yeah. Gundams. Of course, a bit too expensive, lah. Mm -hmm. uh, the you know the TT homies and whatnot. Uh, then I was uh, is it on the same level, right, as the Kai Sin store? Yes, Kai Sin is just close that, to that side. Oh. Okay, so I was like going through there, I was walking here and then suddenly I saw the symbol, I saw the red symbol and I was thinking, okay, either it sells uh, jewelry or something and then, then I, upon further reflection it's triangle, upside down and it 
must be the the symbol for Neo Zion. <laughs> then I was going, oh shit, oh. Then I came closer, a eh? red comet and a little Nendroid Shah symbol there. So and I see the figures is all excellent, and it's a Warhammer workshop with Gundams. Yeah. Excellent, excellent indeed. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay, uh, can you tell me what other places uh, that have Gundams in Penang? This one, you have to go to Prince Bay Mall. Ah, there are two, I've done them already. Mm -hmm. Then, that's all. Yeah. There's another workshop, uh, if I'm not, not mistaken, uh, somewhere around the jetty area. Jetty? Yep. Jetty area? No, never heard about that. Uh, yeah, there is a workshop. Workshop la. Workshop for Gundams? Never yeah, yeah. That. there is. I think I think you want me to show you? One or two minutes from Prangin yes. Mall, huh? which we are where we are now. So you've been there, so is it okay? Uh, actually, last time we are part of the partner also. Oh, part of the partner, lah, but now splintered. Lah. Uh, no, but for the moment, we are starting for the Warhammer. Oh, Warhammer, yeah. lah. and that's for Gundams. Lah. Part of Gundam. Part of Gundam, yeah. lah. but they sell, they sell all these uh, paints and stuff. Lah. Yeah. That's the main in, uh, source of income, not the models. Lah. Yep, uh, you can say, oh, pardon, what is it? Uh, the main income is the the paints and not really. It not just really. depends on the on what kind of people they are trying to buy. Oh, okay, okay. Maybe they come or come for buying some tools like the cutter or bread. Uh -huh. Maybe they are buying for paint uh -huh. and models. Maybe. Oh, nobody sell models as well, and, yeah. and they have a it's a workshop, lah. Huh? Workshop. Oh, you mean the model line? Ah, yeah, they are, they workshop. Are workshop also. Oh, okay. So I guess uh, I'll be going there later. After open, six, after six or after go there, break. You better wait until seven o'clock. The best time. Uh, why is it very busy during the first hour? No, because uh, the workers over there sometimes will come early, sometimes will come late. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. I just need to like go over the overview of the place, what it is, what it has. Uh. No, because I don't know that if the worker is not if the worker is not arrived, <laughs> the shop is not open. Oh, like this, uh. Okay, uh, that's it. Uh, that's it about this Gundam Hunt. See you in Malaysia. Bye bye.